In this tutorial, I'd like to show you Fast Mask from Lawn Road. Fast Mask is a versatile, easy to use masking tool, perfect for color correction, vignettes, masking, and more. Fast Mask was designed exclusively for Final Cut Pro 10 and includes both Effect and Titles versions. The Effect version, located in the Effects browser under Lawn Road Fast Mask, is perfect for compositing with layers. The Titles version, located in the Titles browser under Lawn Road Fast Mask, is great for color correction and cloning or removing multiple objects. Each version includes the original Fast Mask effect and Fast Mask color with built-in color correction parameters. I'll drag the Effects version of Fast Mask Color onto my clip in the timeline. I'd like to use it to affect specific parts of my clip, usually called a secondary color correction. Right away, you'll notice the on-screen controls, which, along with the shape slider and the parameters, give you the power to mask a wide range of objects quickly. You can control the mask's scale, position, rotation, shear, and roundness, all from the canvas, with further fine-tuning in the parameters. I'd like to create a window around the car in the middle and color correct so it becomes the featured portion of the image. In the parameters, you have the option to feather your mask and can feather X and Y independently. You can invert your mask to show everything in your clip outside the shape. I'll turn the background opacity up to 100% to see the full image. You can make your mask a color overlay and easily adjust its intensity. Now I'll do my color correction. I'll increase the highlights and tweak the contrast to make the center portion of this image pop. I have all sorts of additional color correction parameters at my disposal as well, like color balance, saturation, etc. Now I'll drop a second fast mask color effect on my clip and use a rectangle shape around the pavement in front of the car. I'd like to decrease the brightness so your eye is really drawn to the car and the driver. I'll crank the feathering to its maximum but take X feather to zero, so I'm only feathering the top. I'll increase the background opacity. Then I'll use the color correction section to decrease the brightness of the masked section. I'll add in a slight amount of blur for a depth of field effect. Now I'll toggle my two stacked fast masks so you can really see how I've changed the image to make it much more interesting. Being able to create masks in Final Cut Pro 10 for color correction, cloning, removing, or blurring is essential in day-to-day -day editing and Fast Mask is the best and most powerful set of masking effects for Final Cut Pro 10. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at noiseindustries.com.